What's up, everybody? My name is Matt, aka The Constant, and today we're trying the new Impossible Escape game mode in Fortnite and ultimately showing you guys how to win this game mode. Now, to begin, there are two different modes for the Impossible Escape. If you come over here, you will see Impossible Escape PvE and PvP. Both of these modes are squads. The PvE is player versus the environment. You won't be versing any other real players. You'll have real players on your team. And PvP, you'll be versing real players. Now, as you can see, both of these have some text above them if you win the pve one you get yourself a loading screen and if you win the pvp one you get yourself a victory umbrella and this right here is the victory umbrella that you get from winning this game mode let me know what you guys think of this umbrella from 1 to 10 give it a rating i think i personally rate it a solid 8 out of 10 we're about to jump into a game of impossible escape you know i gotta ask you guys to leave a like on the video it does help out a ton thank you guys for doing so and if you're not yet subscribed to the channel i would love for you guys to subscribe and help us on our road to 4k thank you guys so much if you did just subscribe let me know down in the comments so i can heart your comments and if you'd like to support me even further you guys can use code the constant all one word in the fortnite item shop big thank you to everyone using my code you guys are all awesome now without further ado let's make an impossible escape okay we seem to be stranded on an island escape the island Okay, okay. Dawn, day one of three. Store my closing, 31 minutes and 50 seconds. Okay, so this is the island right now. We're at Steamy Stacks. This is the actual Battle Royal Island. All right, and as you guys can see, we're on the island with 16 other people. You guys can see the 16 in the top right corner underneath the map. This right here is the PVE version, not the PVP version. We'll be doing that after this one. As you can see, you get mats a lot slower in this mode, and I believe they're capped at 100. And as you you can see right here we are capped at 100 wood so i'm going to start heading on over to the binoculars on the map the yellow ones that you can see right over here tower discovered climb the tower to reveal nearby objectives okay okay your map has been updated. So you can see the missions over here on the left side. Repair a choppa to escape the island. That is our overall goal. High five other players to form squads and seek out the hunt master for extra hints and a quest. I gotta assume that's the hunt master, right? Talk to the hunt master. Okay, okay. Hunt master, hello, hello, who are you? Talk to the hunt master. Hey there, you look lost. Maybe we can help each other. I woke up stranded here. Do you know a way off the island? I've seen some choppas around, but you'll need to find the missing parts to repair them. If you bring me a raptor claw, I can show you where some are. All right, raptor claws to find the missing parts. She will show them on the map. Very helpful. All right, there is a weapon finally. My goodness, a couple different weapons actually. Dusk, danger, emerge. Yeah, that does look like danger. Please. Okay, we've eliminated a wolf. There's a lot of these wolves. I don't know about this. So I'm thinking you don't want to be outside when the dusk falls. Wait, I think I have a friend here. Hello. We are on the same team. No, we're on the same team. We got a high five. There we go. We have got a friend on our team now. So this should be a little bit easier, and that's how you squad up with people. Pro tip, if you guys do not want to talk to the people that you're squatting up with, make sure to turn off the voice chat when you come in here, because if you squat up with people, you'll be able to hear them instantly. But of course, I'm sure the people that you're playing with would love to talk to you, so if you have your voice chat on, you'll be able to talk to the people that you squat up with. So, so far, you guys can see that weapons and ammo are not the most prevalent on the island. They're pretty scarce. I found another hunt master, hello. All right, this vehicle, can it drive? No, it can't. I gotta run. Okay, wait, the dusk is gone and dawn is here. Day two of three. Okay. They have left. All right, now I'm just gonna head to a choppa over here. Okay, there is a person who just rifted. Repair the escape choppa. We need four different parts, it looks like. Follow the golden map icons to find the choppa parts. So again, these are choppas on the map that you can choose to repair. So you have to coordinate with your teammates to repair the same choppa. I'm gonna fire this into the air. And your position was revealed on the map. Awesome stuff. So you can reveal your position by firing one of those into the air. We're on the same team. <laughs> We have to help each other. Yes, there we go, there we go. Boom, there we go, there we go. We have joined each other. We must get parts. Where's he going? 
Where's he pinging? He's pinging Choppa three. Okay, so this person pinged Choppa three. But why? Let's see. Perhaps he already built some of the Choppa out. These guys are bad guys. Why? But I don't, did, did he, he didn't rebuild any of this Choppa out. None of it. None of it was built out. You did not do anything. If you knock these guards, you get something from them as well. Sometimes some peppers, sometimes some of these little crash pads. Whoa, what the heck? You got the zombies in here too? Oh my goodness, there's so many of them. There's too many. And Ronin abandoned my squad, I don't know why. Why would you do this, Ronin? Please. Good luck to you, Ronin. Good luck. All right, so if you get eliminated, you are eliminated for the duration of the game. Keep that in mind. All right, now that we're done investigating, we're gonna go right for the win this time. And by the way, you guys can leave your squad. Just a quick note for you guys, just by doing this emote right here, you can leave your current squad. All right, people are revealing their location. I'm just gonna start flying. I'm gonna rift. Let's get out of here. Wait, there's a part right there. So you guys can find the parts because they're guarded by these people. These rust lords will guard the parts, it seems. Hello, part number one. Collect. That's not the part. I need to swap it. Oh my goodness, it takes up so much inventory space. Bunker chest, don't mind if I do. Another pump. This fire also seems to be doing something else. Maybe letting people know of my location on the map. I really should meet up with other people. I gotta let them know that I have a part. I hear a friend. Please, no, wait, hold on. Oh my goodness. Hello, friend, I'm here. I'm here to help. Oh, carry that part. Oh my goodness. Yeah, get that part. We'll bring it on over. All right, all right, I'm following my friend. Hey, get away, back away. We need to deliver this. Oh no. Knocked him. So what can I do here? Install part, boom. Installed it. Two installed. Now we must find two more parts, my good Neymar. We've become friends. Oh, by the way, eat, eat some meat. Eat some of that. You need that. I see a car. Hello, friends. Hello. I mean, I, I could high five. Boom. Joined it. Pretty awesome. Okay, now they're pinging. We'll see, but no, but one already has. Wait, why that? No, they installed the motor. The other one has the other one though. I see someone's bringing the other part to helicopter one. So as you guys can see, you can see all the parts installed on whatever helicopter it is in the bottom left over here on your map. So all we need here is just this one. Bring it to helicopter one and we're good. I, I appreciate what you guys are trying to do, but it's a lot easier than you guys are making it out to be. So, okay, thruster. All right, we got a thruster. Can we drive with the thruster? That is the question. Yes, we can. Six seconds till the storm starts closing, but it won't matter because I have this. Board the chopper to escape. Don't leave squad mates behind. I'm coming to get you guys, even though you did nothing. Can you get in? Can you do it? I believe. I don't know where our other friend is though. Nah, there's nothing down there. What do you mean? What's down there? Are we filling it? Is it still on empty? Where's the nearest fuel? Gas can. I got it. Can you complete it with the storm closing in is the question. Okay, there it is. There it is. Can we make it in the storm? One tick. It's one tick. We can do this. I believe. Do you guys believe? Do you believe? <laughs> Go down, maybe? I don't know. Oh, wait, it's up here. Oh, okay. Escape Royale. We did it. Boom. <laughs> if we return to the lobby, we got some V-Bucks. That's not part of this, though. That's just the challenges for the skin that I have. And then, boom, we got Impossible Odds, the loading screen. Now, I'm just going to really quickly jump into the PvP mode, person versus person, where you're versing other real people. Now, to be honest, I'm not sure that I'm going for a win in this one because I got to get the video out, but I will still show you what the differences are. So you can still emote to join a squad and you can still leave a squad. If you were to do either of those things, that would differentiate between being able to fight the person and not fighting the person. If they're on your squad, you obviously wouldn't fight them, but if they're not on your squad, and you have a full squad already and don't want to recruit them, then you can eliminate them. So I'm going to rift over to this guy and see if he wants to be a partner with me. Hello, hello, hello. 
Boom. There we go. That's how you do it. There we go. This team seems like the team right now. Maybe not. So maybe that's fate. My game did crash right there. So maybe it's just telling me to get the video out right now. You guys know the differences between PVP and PVE. If you have any other questions, let me know down in the comments. Again, the PVP portion, you guys want to find your squad. And then once you have a full squad and once you've recruited people, then eliminate people because they're your enemies. Playing through this mode, there's a lot of confusion on actually how to play and what to do. Definitely try to get with your teammates and try to figure out what you guys are doing before you guys actually do it and repair different choppas, etc. Be sure to look at your map and be sure to look at the bottom left where it tells you how many parts you need left to complete each choppa. It is very helpful in actually completing the challenge. I hope you guys learn how to play this game mode and get your victory royale, get your umbrella and your loading screen. I'll be getting my umbrella later on tonight. If you obviously play with your friends, it's easier to do this than with randoms as well. Either way, if you guys did enjoy the video or find it helpful, please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. It helps us on a road to 4,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much. I'll be streaming Fortnite later on today here on YouTube. If you're free come hang out with us thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one